This is Gottfried Wilhelm von Leibniz, one of the most prominent figures in our recorded history in terms of mathematics. He pioneered the development of differential and integral calculus in the notation we most commonly use today. Additionally, he refined the binary number system, the foundation for all digital technology. But putting aside his mathematical pursuits, Leibniz was also a philosopher, one who believed in a god. In his best-known work, The Monadology, Leibniz outlines his perfect world theory. An argument outlined in five statements that must be true, which proves that the world we live in is the best possible world, and all of the evil we suffer is part of God's design. It goes as follows. One, God has the idea of infinitely many universes. Two, only one of those universes can actually exist. Three, God's choices are subject to the principle of reason. That is, God has reason to choose one thing or another. Four, God is good. Five, therefore, the universe that God chose to exist is the best of all possible worlds. Now, upon first look, this might seem perfectly concise and round out his entire argument without flaw. However, I believe Leibniz forgot a sixth statement that needed to be included, which I would like to include right now. Six, God is alive. Because when I look at our world and all its injustice, I can't help but wonder, perhaps 